Hello everyone, welcome to Behind the Eye of Odin. I'm your host Eric, and today I'm going to be reviewing Way of the Horn God by Dancing Rabbit. Now, Way of the Horn God is a book that was written for, well, quite specifically for young men in the pagan craft. There are not very many of those types of books out there. Uh, there are a few, but this one is quite specifically centered for young men who are either starting in the craft or just, you know, having a hard time getting getting their feet wet, so to speak. Now, as I read the book, I realized that it was actually quite an easy read, so I, I definitely enjoyed that. I liked that part. I, there weren't too many words that I had to look up. There were a few, and, you know, being in my 30s, that doesn't happen often, but there wasn't a couple. It's, it's not a terribly difficult book to understand. Uh, the overall feel of the book is that it's, it is centered specifically for young men uh, trying to make their way in the craft. It explains everything from uh, beginning rituals to uh, some of the things that you can do for your own coming-of-age rituals. I mean, it covers the whole span, and it's a fantastic book for that. Um, the rituals themselves, there were quite a few, I'd say almost a little excessive on the number of rituals that ex are explained in the book. Uh, it wasn't too bad. I mean, it was, it was, like I said, an easy read. There were a few more rituals listed and explained in the book than... than I was ready for, but if this is a beginner book for you, it's fantastic because it goes step by step, the breakdown of the rituals and the tools that you'll need, the lists are there, the steps are there, uh, the breakdown itself is actually quite concise and quite good and really quite easy to understand. Um, Let's see, the advice that you'll get out of the book, everything from how to talk to your parents about it, to how to deal with your frustration in uh, lack of, of ritual space and whatnot, and even some of the thoughts on how to deal with sex. The advice is wonderful in the book, and I've, I've actually learned a couple of things from it. Uh, so that's, that's quite good. Um, out of out of everything that I read out of this book, one of the things that uh, one of the things that I found was absolutely fantastic, and why I will recommend this book to any young, young man uh, entering the craft or seeking more information about ritual magic or paganism in general, is uh, the book in many many places and in many ways expresses that as opposed to talking about it and writing it down in your book of shadows or in your journal or whatever you happen to keep to go out and actually do the things that are listed and are are uh, available to you not only uh, doing clean cleansing rituals from starting with the actual go out and clean your room which I found absolutely amusing and fantastic all at the same time but also coming of age ritual it explains that and says that if no one else is willing to do that for you then you should go out and do it also that you know keeping the earth a greener place by composting and breaks down how to compost and whatnot but overall i really did enjoy the book it's called way of the horned god by dancing rabbit um I, I got it in PDF, so I don't have a copy to show you, unfortunately, but I do recommend it. So go, and if you can get it on PDF, I believe you can buy it on Amazon, but go and check out the book. Uh, Amazon does have a preview for the book where you can read a little bit of the first chapter or two. Um, thanks for watching, guys, and uh, I, hope you've, I hope you've enjoyed this video, and until next time, Odin be with you. Kernana sign pan and I heard. 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 I'm the horn god, I'm the face in the trees. I'm the breath of the wind that rustles the leaves. 
I'm the green man in the wildwood I roam Can on a sign pan and I 